Hello there, it's me, Scott Diggs Underwood. You might remember me from the title cards of Ed, Ed, and Eddie, or you might not. Anyways, I've been working here at AKA Cartoon in Vancouver, Canada for about eight years on the show, and I've kind of learned how to draw Eddie a little bit. So I'm gonna show you in five steps how I draw Eddie. Who's the man with the plan? Eddie! First, I like to start with the gesture, or it's kind of the skeleton or the spine of what Eddie's going to be doing. In this case, he's mad, so I try to think in my head a kind of a mad pose. Step two is uh, roughing in his head shape, his body shape. Eddie, being a block head, gets a block for a head, a bit of a block for a body, and a little bit of a block for his legs. Step three is kind of adding, start to add the face, the eyes, what kind of expression he's making. So, like I said, he's mad. Ah! So I start to rough in his eyes, and they're always kind of wonky. They're not always the same size or anything. And like I said, he's mad, so we'll give him some mad eyebrows. And a mad mouth. So we start to see Eddie's attitude at this point. <laughs> Step four is going even further, add a little bit more details, add his arms. And I do them with a little stick with a ball on the end, just to show where they're gonna be. And I start to rough in where the sleeves are. Well, if he's wearing a shirt, I mean, a lot of times he's naked, like in Pop Goes the Head. So I rough in a bit of his sleeves and his shirt and his pants. His pants are a bit baggy, so I like to put a couple wrinkles at the bottom. Don't forget his wallet chain. He wouldn't go anywhere without his wallet. It's usually probably empty. So I keep going with that. start to see Eddie take shape. And once I see some rough lines that I'm okay with, I'll darken them up right away. Little X ears, darken in his eyes once I'm happy with them. Add those little lines beside his eyes. Not sure what they are. They don't exist in nature but they exist here on Ed and Eddie. Now let's round up some suckers. His top lip and the top of his head. Even his hairs can show how angry he is. And I keep going. Now we're kind of going into step five a little bit where I am adding like the collar, the button, the little line on his shirt. And then with the balls that I made on the end of the sticks, those make perfect fists for Ed, or Eddie rather, to be mad. Perhaps at Ed. I'm not little! Perhaps a double D. I'm not short! Or Johnny. Tell Blank to quit fooling around! And the other fist. Couple shoes. This being step five, gotta make sure I added all the stuff, like the shoes and the wallet chain. We're hot! So there you have Eddie, and he's mad. That's a prominent feature in Eddie, his anger. Shut up, Sarah! I don't know if it stems from his childhood or from simple social interactions gone awry. Couldn't really tell you, but there he is, Eddie, from Ed, Ed, and Eddie. Thank you for watching me draw 